Sometimes I attribute my weirdness to all the TV shows I used to watch. Maybe they would have taught me more life lessons if they had a different host. <laughs> Welcome to all my little girls and little boys and little whatever the fuck you supposed to be. My name is Mrs. Shanene, and I'm going to teach y'all a little something about life. Ooh, I wouldn't get too excited. I mean, life can be rough. Life can be like a big, nasty, fat prison inmate fucking you from behind with no warning and definitely no lube. But today I'm going to teach you some things that hopefully make your life a little less of a OH SHIT! And a little bit more of a OH SHIT! Are you a boy or a girl? Lesson number one. Stupid people get their ass shot. Story time! Yay! Once upon a time, there lived a beautiful princess who was born with hair so long it reached the floor. Okay, now that's a load of bullshit. Alright, you cannot have hair that long and be natural. You gotta buy that shit. Either that or you gotta go to India and scalp a bitch. Anyways, she fell in love with a poor jobless slave that lived nearby. What? Oh, hell no. Okay, I am sorry, but if you want to get between these hips, you better be packing between your wallet lips, homie. I cannot be with no broke-ass motherfucker. I mean, what if he rips his condom on my piercing and he knocks me the fuck up? I can't afford to have a baby by myself, and I definitely can't have another miscarriage because I've already had 19 of them this month. I mean, if I shove any more coat hangers up there, I'm gonna look like J.C. Penney's on Black Friday. You know what I'm saying? And they all lived broke as a damn joke and unhappily ever after. The end. Today, I want to give y'all some life lessons. Like why you should never fuck a Samoan. Why aliens abduct little children in the middle of the night to do testing. And why, even though gay men can be fun, fashionable, and cute, the sex they be having is pretty disgusting. I mean, I don't get it. That shit feels like you pooping backwards. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? I feel like you do. Oh, and let's not forget about the N-word and how much fun it is to say. Let's everybody say it. Nick! Caught! What? I thought it was going good. We was about to play with knives. Yeah, maybe not. Either way, I would spend a lot more time in the guidance counselor's office than I would in the actual classroom. And she wasn't the best at listening to my problems. But hey, at least it wasn't like Paris Hilton or something. Can you imagine? So, tell me and Tinkerbell your problems. My parents said if I don't get straight A's, they're gonna disown me. My parents said if I got straight A's, they would buy me Africa and kick out all the black people so I could use it as my own personal tanning bed. I just feel like nobody ever listens to me. Tinkerbell, you won again, you little bitch! <laughs> what were you saying? <sighs> I don't know what's wrong with me. It's like every time I look in a mirror, I think I'm fat. Think? What do you see when you look at this? A butterfly? That's correct. What about this? Kim Kardashian? I'm sorry, the answer is fat whore. And the worst is that I'm addicted to watching porn. Have you watched mine? Yeah. What did you think? Uh, it was okay, I guess. Get the fuck out. Yeah, could have been worse. <laughs>